Hi guys, Jeff here, and welcome back to Soma. <sighs> okay, so in the last part, we escaped the, the scary clutches of Disco Ballhead Naked Dude uh, in the wreck of the Curie. And um, now we're in Delta Station, and we're trying to get to Theta Station. I really want to get on this Zeppelin cargo transport. I, I hope we get to find that thing. Okay, I'm just looking at all the things. Look at all the things! Delta Station. Theta Station is... Looks like it's pretty close by. Omicron. So Theta... Delta looks like it's right on an outcropping over a very deep part of the ocean. Omicron is where we're going after Theta, Tau, Phi, oh, I wonder if we'll ever go to Omega. I hope we get to see all the stations, to be completely honest, because they're all just so damn cool. Should I touch you? I'll touch you. Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, look at this. What do we have here? UH manual. Complex AN777. U, universal helper. Oh, Herb Herbie. While the K8 lacks a voice module, it is able to communicate via simplified sounds and lights. And grunts and adorableness. Uh, complex. Oh, okay, so they have intelligence units. Okay. Medium worker, remote pilot supported, which is the bull. Okay. The topa, which is bomberman, mini UH, no remote pilot. Okay, I don't know what you could possibly do, but. And the qualia. Okay. Oh, okay. So this is the 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 guy, the ones that are floating around that are um, possessed <laughs> and are evil. Uh, research vessel, remote pilot, mandatory. Right, right. So that means that they've got the ghosts trapped inside them somehow, or at least a consciousnesses. The vessel has basic intelligence; only a pilot is needed to fully utilize its equipment. Okay. Messages. Ooh, I like messages. From Consted D D Theta. Uh, subject Delta Evacuation. Terry, it's been decided that you and your crew will evacuate to Theta on the 14th. Everything is being taken care of, and you will all be given new positions as you arrive. You will have to fall into the ranks, of course. The last thing we need are more leaders. More followers, less leaders. Uh, fuck you, Cronsted. I'm not going anywhere. You don't have the authority to make me. Terry. This isn't my orders, you idiot. I'm just the messenger. You want to stay? I can buy you some time if you want to hang out at your dump. But your crew is moving tomorrow. Kronstedt. Strasky. Evacuation successful. Mr. Akers. Akers. Mr. Akers. I'm happy to inform you that your crew has safely arrived at Theta. Let me know when you are ready to move, and I'll send a transport. Peter Strasky, Theta Dispatch. Strasky, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Mr. Akers, or Akers. Don't hesitate to ask if you want to be reallocated or relocated to Theta. Oh, man, I cannot read today. Peter Strasky, Theta Dispatch. So, Akers... Akers, I think, is a key player in all of what's going on here. Local access. Ackers. 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 Terry Ackers won his 1,000th game of chess. Ackers. Ackers. I don't know what today's date is. Has he been here today? Chess. Games won. Games lost. Do I want to play chess? Oh, okay. Good. I'm sure you wanted to watch me play chess. I'm so good at it. Such a pro. Actually, I did beat my dad once, <laughs> which is 
really surprising because he's he's damn good. Um, I don't know, maybe he was just off that day. Got herself a bathroom. Is there a head in the toilet? No, nope. no creepy things in the toilet. Okay. Is that all, all there is to see here? So this is some kind of control... Oh, are we in the HQ? No. This isn't the main... I'm confused. Okay. Oh, man, there's... I love exploring. Like, a lot of love and care goes into the level design and the overall kind of ambience. What's it? So that was the HQ based on that map. And it, I just... Ah, I just love it so much. Because there's always little cool things, like these little things just hidden around, waiting to be found and explored. Are you good or bad? Hmm. I'm not glitching. Hell of a day. Am I right? Can't believe how much I'm sweating in this suit. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, hey, could you maybe help? I need to get the Theta. Don't worry about it. I got this. Hey, you. Help me out of here, will you? Listen. Don't worry about it. I got this. Hey, can you hear me? Don't stand there. You know better than that. <laughs> okay. Yeah. You put in a good word for me? <laughs> I'm not sure that's a good thing. Nah, I'm just messing with you. Oh, okay. I'm, in I'm very interested to find out exactly why and how there's all these um, people's minds stuck in these machines. What is this? <gasps> Ooh, some kind of radar dish? Oh, that's cool. No signal. No signal. No signal. No signal. It's a radio relay. That's what it is, right? No signal. Okay, so what happens? Oh. Oh, wait a minute. Uh-huh. I don't know what that does. <laughs> you know what? Um, I'm going to write down these numbers. So yellow was 049. Back to channel 2. Green was 840. And. Oops. Go back this way. That's really cool. Brandon, did you move the Carthage casing? We need to test that one before okay. we ship it. Red is 216. I have no idea. Man, you can really tell when Astrid is off platform. This place turns into such a locker room. <laughs> Not in a good way, either. Mm. There's a good way to be in a locker room? I never had a good experience in a locker room. Um, I don't know, man. I just say we can keep things classy, even when women aren't around. I you completely know? agree. I completely agree. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, you're so full of shit, Brandon. I've seen you when payload manager Alice Coster shows up. Yeah, I don't know if it was important to write down those numbers, but anytime there's numbers, it seems like it should be important. Okay. Oh, great. Just what I want to see. 
Just when I want to see blood everywhere. What made the blood? What the fuck is that shit? Eyeballs. Oh, I don't like this already. Mm. Okay, before we get to the eyeballs. What is this? We got some drawings here. Are those spiders? No, oh, there better not be spiders. I am not prepared for spiders. Coral, coral, coral. The light is burning my eyes. He's telling me I don't need this... Virtuous? Vitreous flesh inside my skull to be... To see salvation. I will gladly remove them. Stop them from obfuscating the divine vision. Jesus. Hold on. What happens if I... There we go. I mean, uh, vit, vit, vitria, vitreous, vitreous flesh. I don't know what that means. I'm gonna get to the eyeballs. I promise. Just want to see what else we've got here. My reflection in the black blood of our warden whispers. I need to save them from this hell. Let them sleep. Lock them in the lucid dreams I've seen. My reflection in the black blood of our warden whispers. I need to save them from this hell. Let them sleep. I don't understand. Black blood seems to keep coming up over and over again. Uh, okay, I don't, I don't want to know what's in that locker. <laughs> There's chess again. Boom. Uh, it's exciting to watch. Wow. Claim Delta. Half a year ago, I'd be worried. I'd have Goya and Wan clear the black blood from the machinery. Now its crusty surfaces seem to be seem to complement, even outshine what Delta was. Hmm. I'd have Goya and Wan clean the black blood from the machinery. Hmm. Curious, 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 curious. What does that mean? Oh, come on. There we go. All right, let's look at the eyeballs. Oh, lovely. Ah. That's fucking disgusting. <laughs> okay, so whoever was here ripped his eyeballs out. Is there anything else I'm supposed to... Oh yeah, right, there's a computer here. Chess. Oh, ripped opponent. Is that all I can do with this? Okay. There's no touching... What are these? Okay. Oh, oh, I'm back outside. There we go. Okay. Um... Right? This is... I like this level. Um... It's kind of a puzzle. Of sorts. Can I go up this ladder? No. Careful, Simon. Careful. Wah. Why is that so terrifying? Black abyss. Okay. So we've been inside that. Anything with a, a sign on top of it usually usually has a door, right? So let's see if there's a door to this thing. I may 
may be wrong about that theory. Okay. At least there's no bad guys out here. I mean, as much as I'm sure it's enjoyable to watch me flee in terror, my poor nerves could not withstand constant barrage of adrenaline. Okay. Can I go inside this building? These giant cables. Got some kind of rail system here. That's interesting. So, okay. Maybe I follow the rails. Hey, Baldo. Okay. okay. That's just another sign. I'm getting confused. Okay, we're gonna. Keep exploring here. Control room. Are we in here? No, we were not. Okay. Let's go inside. Oh, we can't go inside. Oh, I like you. I like you. This guy, he knows what's up. He knows how to help. Universal helper droid. I like droids. Thanks, buddy. Okay, so this is just underwater. Fuck. <gasps> wow. What happened to you? All right, well, let's find out what happened. You saw that, right? You saw Akers fucking injecting that shit into them? What? It got me pretty bad. I think I made it worse pulling away. I, I can feel it bleeding out. What? Can you see him? Fuck. He got on a Zeppelin. He's going back to Theta. We have to warn them. Good luck with that. The platform radio is dead. Remember? The Lumar Annex should work. It has to. Yeah. You go. I'm not gonna make it. I'm just not. Come on, Evans. We have to warn him. Come on! Hmm. Hmm. Oh, you poor bastard. So they got injected by Ackers. That's what that, I guess, that weird blood coming from that person in the photograph was all about, maybe. But what is it? I can feel it bleeding out. What is it? Is it a parasite? Is this the lights? Oh, yeah, it's the lights. Okay. Hey, Herbie, you're just floating in circles. Oh, I turned the power on in the station. Okay. Okay. What do we have here? Zeppelin control remote. Remote access denied. Remote admin. Remote access denied. Override. Invalid command. Override. Komorebi. Com Responder right suspended. Fuck you, hackers. Invalid command. So... I guess they tried to call the Zeppelin? Or tried to stop the Zeppelin, maybe. Okay, so that was the access log. Messages. Stras Strasky, Theta, Zep. Hackers is doing some strange shit. He just took the Zeppelin back to Theta. Don't let him dock. Shut it the fuck down. Sent. Unable to establish link. I'm getting a... It's like a pattern with these links. Area map, okay. Alright, zoom in, and I'm inside... Calm antenna, we were there, we were there, we were there. 
So we haven't actually made it inside the main facility yet. Okay. So it looks like when I come out, I have to hang a left. And go around, I guess maybe I get in through there. Okay. I wonder what they did here. Science? They did science. Okay. Hang a left. Out of here. So this right here... Oh, okay. This is the main facility. Okay, I think this is the platform from that photograph. Okay. Zeppelin transport theta. Delta. Okay, we went in here already. Did I miss something? Or do I have to just have to go around the back of the building? in the back of the building. Alright, well, maybe we just keep walking forward into the ocean. Brain coral. Cool. Saw a huge brain coral in, uh, in, uh, Belize. Ooh. Yeah, okay. So we're do I have to call the Zeppelin transport? Because I seem to be on this little kind of island in the middle of nowhere. And I'm not really seeing... What are those things? What the hell are those? Hmm. Doesn't really help at all. Whee! Bonk. Uh oh. There we go. Okay, I definitely have a calm link thingy. This is gonna be key to me getting wherever I need to get. Hey, you! Make yourself useful. Ah, you get away. Your <laughs> that doesn't even make sense. Come on. Stop messing around and get back to work. Uh, you know, I would... Okay, let's go to the Zeppelin. Maybe there's a, some kind of control screen I missed. This control screen. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. Shipping. Uh, hi, Matsu. Frame components. Basco. Arc shell to Phi. Interesting, that seems key. Delta evacuation to Theta. Como Rebi survey group from Theta. Hmm. Unspecified to Theta. Oh, so they evacuated here. Then they came back. Someone came from Theta to check things out, and I guess they maybe all died. And then he left to Theta. Zeppelins. Ah. Okay. Okay. I see. Yeah. Antenna. Signal strength. 216 seems to be good. Transport positions lost. Manually adjust antenna. Okay, so we've already got it set at 216. Radio. Corrupt audio buffer. Restore files? Okay. Covered two files. Strasky, we can see the Zeppelin now. Good. Sorry about the mess. Without the positioning system, the Zeps just keep losing their set routes. Volgen did say that you could have fixed it on your side by rejigging the antenna. Uh, guess it doesn't matter now. Are, are all of you coming? No, just me, Goy, and Creer. Acres is set up being a stubborn old man. Alright. <laughs> See you soon, Brandon. Happy evac. Okay. One of these guys has to be Brandon. Peter, 
Can you hear me? Uh, I hear you, Terry. I, I mean, Mr. Akers, sir. I've changed my mind. I would like to come to Theta. Let Delta sleep. Of course. Oh, wow. Uh, honestly, didn't expect to hear from you again. Uh, such a long time since you checked in. Uh, we have a few divers in a Zeppelin surveying Lambda at the moment. I'll just... Make sure they pick you up when they're done. Uh, thank you for the warning. I'll make sure they feel welcome. <laughs> okay. Uh, see you when you get here. <laughs> I don't think you made them feel welcome at all, sir. Alright. So. Unable to establish link. Okay. So one of these. Oh no, wait. We're on 216. Transport. Engine failure. Okay. So we'll go 840 and then we'll go 49. Oh yeah, the antenna relay was over here. It's a simple puzzle, but it's a it's a cute little one. Forget it, Akers. I'm not playing with you anymore. As if chess wasn't boring enough. You just have to go and wait in four moves or whatever. Okay. It's one of these. Ah, 49. Did you move the outer shields? Okay. No, the thin one, the healer. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Transport active. Unspecified cargo. Incoming. Zeppelin's on its way. Better hey, get ready. I chose the right one. Better get ready for what? Zeppelin transport theta. Oh, cool. Well, it's definitely the oh, there it is. Unspecified cargo. Cool! Oh, that's awesome! Wow. It's very, um... Very cool design. This reminds me of Half-Life 2. I can't remember the name of the airships, but it looks a lot like one of those. Why am I glitching? Disconcerting popping in and out of existence <laughs> like that. Where are we now? Delta. At least that's what you said before the crash. Oh, right. Of course. Is this a Zeppelin? Appropriately named. You think it can get us to Theta? It's a cargo transport. They use them for moving materials between the sites, anything that's too big for the shuttles. I'm sure it can carry us. Okay. Ah, uh, why won't it work? Come on. Oh, the tool chip is bust. Isn't that part of the Omni tool? Look who's been paying attention. We have to deal with that back at Upsilon. Then you know how it works. We need to get a new tool chip and switch it. Okay. Care to point me in the direction of the closest tool chip storage? I think it would be easier to just take one from a robot. What? Just knock a robot over the head and steal their chips? The toolbox over there says it has a stun baton. You could use that. Come on. I don't want to hurt anyone. Isn't this a bit much? It's just a robot, Simon. We're just robots. Sort of. I'll get us the chip. So... Hmm. Guess I have wow. A, choice. a weapon in a frictional game. Oh, it's just really a tool, I guess. So... I missed the part where he kind of came to terms with the fact that he's... 
a piece of biotechnology? Oh, I don't want to kill you. No, not you. Not you. You've been too helpful. Why don't we kill the other guy? And just, uh, just kind of like make... I mean, he's, st he's stuck in a machine, right? Sorry, dude. I don't want to kill Hermie. It's better this way, right? I'm sorry, buddy. Maybe, maybe. Uh, this works. I don't know. I mean, this stupid game and it's tough moral choices about whether or not you're making... Oh, are you mad at me, Hermie? I'm sorry. I'm not gonna hurt you! It makes me feel bad. I have to end the existence of all these creatures. Well, uh, not creatures, but beings. Sentient beings. This is freaking me out. Um... Yeah, I missed the part where he thought that he was a robot. Um... I mean, it obviously makes sense, and that was kind of my theory I mentioned kind of back a couple episodes ago, that um, my th I had this kind of theory brewing in my head, and my theory is that I'm mechanical, that I'm a robot of some kind, but then again, I was strapped into that pilot chair, um, so I don't quite understand how that all works. Oh, a data buffer. Wonder. Thanks, Simon. Don't be mad, okay? We really needed that chip. We'd, we'd be stuck here. Could you do it? Kill a robot like that? I get attached to them too. I'm not a monster. But in this case, it had to be done. He was talking. I mean, he was delusional, but he seemed sincere present. Yeah, well, I'm sure it's fine. Was he really that different from us? It's just beginning to sink in. I mean, really sink in. I'm a robot. Didn't we cover this already? I guess I've known ever since I woke up at Upsilon. I just keep suppressing it. Like my brain doesn't want me to think about it. It's really getting hard not to think about it. Yeah. Could you maybe hit that switch over there so we could get moving? Oh. Yeah, sure. Hmm. Hmm. Notice the way he says about, or about, about. Doesn't say it like a Canadian. About. I get a lot of flack for that. So I'm gonna point it out when someone's doing it wrong, damn it. Alright. So what do I do? Is this good? What do I do? Where do I push the thing? Huh? Thanks. Yeah, he's just like we've just come to grips that he's a robot. I don't I wanna know when he had this realization. Um cool man. Ooh, where are we going? Oh god, cool. Awesome! Can I jump up here? Probably not a good idea. Where are we going? 
into the blackness of the ocean. That's... not at all disconcerting. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. What's this over here? Mission administration. Okay, You're really good back there, Simon. We got a slight delta detour, but we're back on track. Yeah. We okay. should touch down on a cargo in. platform just outside Theta. Oh. Then we just head inside, grab the duck back, and head down the abyss. 4,000 meters. That's a long way. Wow. We don't have to worry, though, because with the duck back, the Ark could have been in the Mariana Trench. It'll hold for anything. Wow. That's great. And then <laughs> we can start listening to other people when they talk, because that's how conversations work. What? Oh, sorry. I, I just can't stop thinking about what we've become. It's clear that we're no longer human. But then how can I feel like Simon? How can I feel like anything at all? I mean, technically, I don't have any ears, no mouth. Christ, that's a weird thing to think about. I mean, I'm making sounds. I'm still saying things. You sure are. <sighs> okay. Your new body most likely has senses similar to those you had as a human. And your mind, only knowing one way to perceive the world, superimposes that skill set on top of your new features. Mm -hmm. So my mind is covering it up, pretending nothing's different. If it didn't, you'd probably be incapable of interacting with the world at all. Interesting. And the stress would either kill you or make you go insane. So I've found a good balance between awareness and ignorance. Does that mean I shouldn't think about this stuff, or are my thoughts actually making me cope? Could I tip the balance by suddenly gaining some insight and go insane? I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, we have real <laughs> Don't. things to deal with. Saving mankind, remember? Speaking of which, we're closing in on Theta. I'll eject the Omnitool. How much do you want to bet? Don't forget to take me with you. The uh, calf, before you go, the artificial intelligence you mentioned in the escape vessel? Uh-huh, yeah, the warden unit, the WoW. Is it the WoW's fault that we're like this? I mean, it seems like something an unreliable AI would do. I suppose it set the ball in motion, but it's not directed with purpose. <laughs> it's really complicated to explain how machines think, Simon. Concentrate on getting inside data, okay? See you soon. Hmm. I like this game, man. It is making me think things. Okay, so we're at the payload station for Theta Station. Uh, now is as good a time as any to stop the episode, because we're running very short on time, actually. Um, but man, what nuggets to think about. I mean, I am, I'm a robot. I've come to the realization that my character is a robot. Um, and But I have all the same... Uh, kind of mind uh, that I had back in 2015 when I was a, a flesh and being human being a and and I'm confronted with the choices of ending lives and saving humanity and all of this stuff I'm sure is all going to be linked together just I, what I really want to know above everything else is how and why did my brain scan from 2015 end up here? I hope it's not all a dream. That's that's what I hope the most. I hope I hope this is all real. But I guess what is real? <laughs> oh god, we're going to get philosophical here. But philos you know what? Philosophy in a video game? Fuck. Yes, it's about time. It's about time. There's so much mindless crap in video games and this is something that actually is making you be present and mindful of things and I I for one welcome that I welcome our robot overlords um because it, you know this is what video games should be all about it's all about storytelling and forming a narrative that and, and sci-fi in general too it's not about robots it's not about technology specifically those things are present but it's all about examining the human condition. It's all about examining our place in the universe and what it all means. And, okay, all right, all right, all right. I'm going f way too far down the rabbit hole. Nobody wants to hear this. We'll cut the episode here. Thanks so much, guys, for watching. 
Can't wait to go to Theta Station. I'm sure more terrifying madness awaits us there. Take care. Cheers. Cheers.